or all right so i guess this bio don't have no timer on it but i was just like in my feelings right now about my baby my fur baby and i'm still trying to come to grips with why or who and why was the animal control people called and I used the kipper deck, my kipper deck to start off. And sure enough, all the cards that I thought was going to come out, they came out. The first card that came out was courthouse. We don't need, we don't even have to like really signify the um the twenty three, but clearly it says courthouse on it. So it's like somebody called animal control because they wanted me to have something legally going on because they looked at me as like somebody sent a message that I wasn't like a privileged lady or I wasn't um something pertaining to this privileged lady being like in the reverse so they could they could definitely could have called this could have been like sp spread around or something like like people talking about this together to other people and then clearly like after that house came out with pr imprisonment so it's like somebody definitely was the plan was to have me in this eight of swords energy or to have me like stuck, you know, basically, or to literally have me in jail. Um, but I feel like that was talked about amongst people. So this definitely could have happened in the month of July because the message card has number seven on it. The year that it took place, it could have happened in July, which I believe that's kind of the month it did actually happen in, but I don't have the calendar out right now, but, or the paperwork too. I don't have that like out in front of me right now, but yeah, I feel like the house just represent that, you know, where I was previously, the apartment I was just staying in. Previously, that just what the house represents, but you know, sure enough, somebody did want to have me in this energy, like having me either stuck legally or to like literally have me in um jail. Cause like you know, when I've heard of stuff before, like I've even watched in the past, I've watched um you know the um the animal show, like when they be going to. The animal control people like literally be going to people houses because the dogs like literally be outside around the fucking clock and um they don't have no food or water and stuff like that. I've watched the show like that, but you know that wasn't because somebody did say something like pertaining to they said they made it look like he was in bad health, like only because of his fur because you got bad health we don't the numbers ain't really gotta be significant but it's the cards that came out i feel like the child represents him and then you got courtship so it could have been something with the four or a couple could have been significant they they are behind like whoever called they could be somebody that was in a relationship or they was working together with somebody else but somebody did call that either they was in a they in a relationship, they married, whatever the hell the title is. Um <clears throat> but they was conspiring, I feel like talking with other people about this. And they, you know, they had so much to say about me because, you know, the privileged lady came out in reverse. So their intentions was to most definitely get me caught up in the legal in the legal system because to this day even though i'm not trying to figure it out like i'm not trying to like i'm not even in contact with the lady that was you know defending me but at the time when it was going on i was trying to have them tell me like let me listen to the 911 call or whoever called or you know because you do got a call on the phone but 
they didn't want it to cheat. They act like they ain't have it no more or whatever. So, but anyways, at the back of the deck is adjudication card, coffin. Like they wanted something to come to an end. Cause you got adjudication, you got the, the coffin, you got the gift, and you got change. Yeah, they wanted it to be where the change would be that I would like literally end up in a like um in poverty. Cause if I'm in jail, I can't do what I gotta do, you know? So Basically, I would have lost my, like, if I really ended up doing some time for something that wasn't even, like, serious, it's just that if you go through a period of not having no income coming in and you're not used to that, clearly you're not going to be able to do the things that you normally would be doing. Yeah, so this is, like, what they wanted to happen or they, this the outcome that they thought was going to happen. Yeah, because like I said, to this day, I don't know who called. I, I just feel like it is somebody that around me. I just, they don't have to necessarily be like, I'm talking to them or whatever every day. But it's somebody around me in this, in the community. I know that for a fact. I know that for a fact. Let's see what comes out with the um tarot deck. Cause I don't know, I just was like like I'm just wondering like this ain't even a real I mean it is this is a real reading, but I normally don't even do these on here. But I just wanna see who's gonna pop up on here. Let's see nobody not coming on here yet. Hmm, I wonder why. Um, so let's see. What do we need to see to clarify this? That's already out here. Pertaining to who called the animal control about snow. Because clearly I wasn't. Yeah, you got the ace of wands. Somebody took some passionate action to do so with calling animal control about snow. It had a lot of, yeah, because look, the Ace of Pentacles came out too because they definitely thought they was about to get some kind of victory. The Ace of Pentacles came out sideways on top of the Ace of Wands. Somebody definitely, most definitely was betting on having a victory of something that they was doing behind the scenes. Yeah, the High Priestess just turned over. Doing something and like removing themselves from the situation or acting like they didn't have nothing to do do with it or they wasn't doing anything. What else to clarify this ace of wands, ace of pentacles pertaining to who called animal control on me about my dog? What else to clarify this energy? The emperor. So somebody that this could be either a father figure or somebody that felt like they got some kind of power or control over over things or people or something like that. Dang, all of those came out. The star and the chariot. Yeah, somebody this could be somebody that um I don't know why I'm getting like travel or something like that. But the Ace of Pentacles also came out in reverse. Then you got the Queen of Pentacles at the back of the deck. So yeah, this somebody, this Queen of Pentacles could be a relative or not a relative. Definitely somebody in the Queen of Pentacles energy that thought there was going to be some kind of ending or unexpected change with them, them getting some kind of wish fulfillment out of moving something along or... And having something in motion that, you know, like, I, yeah, moving something along. Yeah, but they, whoever this is, they, they in this, like, devil energy. And it's judgment on them for that. 
Yeah, they could be, they could have been clouded by some kind of judgment or their, their actions was clouded by somebody else. Something, like I said, something that they, it was like a, a reason, it was a hidden motive reason behind why they did what they did. Because they felt like they was in regret or crying over, um, crying over, um, spilled milk about something. It's messed up when people be wanting to do things to you. And um, the whole time you feel like you've been going through stuff, you ain't been doing no nothing to nobody else. Even with people doing stuff or whatever, whatever's going on, whether they saying stuff, doing stuff, whatever, you ain't been doing nothing back to nobody. But people feel like they got to have the initiative to do something because they got so much entitlement to act like they feeling some type of way about something yeah the queen of swords them acting like they got some entitlement to feel some way about doing something they felt like they had a lot of logic and it was uh, strategic at what they was doing to this king of wands When all you be doing out here, or ever since you had, ever since I'm talking like in the, ever since I had my dog, um, only thing I did was work at home and taking care, care of him. In between there, it was other stuff too, but it's like my main stuff was him, me, and trying to make sure I had somewhere to be when I got out of work as far as somewhere to come home you know somewhere to come to so I just don't get people yeah look nine of wands nine of cups that's what somebody wanted for me they wanted me to be in that limbo energy between the nine of wands and them or the nine of cups and nine of wands because I wish I could just that would just solve a lot of shit if I could just know exactly who called them about me and my dog. What else to clarify this energy out here? The Ace of Cups. What about this um, Star Chariot Ace of Cups? All right, so this pe whoever this was, they was working with other people, like I said. They was definitely working with somebody to juggle something like, yeah, to basically to keep me, like I said, in that nine of cups, nine of wands energy. Yeah, they definitely took a risk and a leap of, a leap of faith to do so. And look at that dog on the picture on the car. It looked just like snow. I feel like somebody didn't like that. You got the nine, you got this full card, the nine of pentacles, the four of pentacles, the five of cups. The moon card with the four of cups, king of wands, five of wands, seven of swords, king of pentacles, the sun card. So it could have been like somebody traveled somewhere because you got the um the emperor, the star, the chariot. So it's like somebody could have traveled somewhere to do something and then after they did what they did, they was gone or whatever. Or they just been keeping they or it's they keep just keep them keeping a distance. Knowing what the hell they did. I hope I'll be able to put this on YouTube. What else to clarify this energy? 
Clarify this Eight of Pentacles, the Four card for this energy. The thing to who called the animal control on me. Yeah. Whoever did this, they definitely took the risk to leap of faith to have me heartbroken. To have me, to make me feel like I did the most wrong by my dog. But let me sit up here and call on somebody about their kids or something like that. Let, let me go and do that. It'll be a whole dang problem about that. Clarify the um, Eight of Pentacles, the Fool, the, st uh, the Three of Swords. Clarify the Eight of Pentacles, the Fool, and the Three of Swords. But people want to call you, oh, you bitter and you you miserable and all this shit, but... But then you you still was doing shit to, to this person behind the scenes, but you expect them to be like all oh, like, you know, knowing that motherfuckers this shit. But then you think they want to be around you. Yeah, you got the five of wands, knight of wands, the king of pentacles. I'm putting it back. Clarify the full card and the three of swords. Yeah, six of pentacles, six of swords. So somebody definitely wanted to have me in this heartbroken because they was collaborating with somebody. It's like either somebody told them and then they call or whether it was a male or a female confirmation, whatever that noise was. And now we're getting the interruptions. Um... But yeah, they did what the fuck they did. They did it behind the scenes. They did it to cause grief and... How you say? Inconvenience. They might have had some kind of equal give and take with somebody. Because they did what they did and then maybe they got money for doing it, doing it or something. Because you got, again, you got the Six of Swords with the Six of Pentacles. Because they just knew. And then they even probably had people watching, like, coming to see what was going on. Because, like, when I was going through the whole thing with the court thing, I feel like even though people was having court, they self, like, their own situation, I still, yeah, look, to the pinnacles at the back of the day. This could represent the um, community or money. It could have been, like, a, a feminine energy giving people money in this community or something like that. To go watch this other person to see what was going on or what was like happening. Like to see what the outcome was going to be. Or this could be a male that could have did this. Whoever, however it go. Or however it resonate. Yeah, because they, yeah. Somebody definitely was um manipulating something. Or using some kind of magic to manipulate this person to do what they did. Or manipulating this person to come watch to see what was going on with this justice energy. Or like to try to manipulate something so that it wouldn't go in my favor. What else to clarify this energy? And I feel like they didn't even stop at that. So, but that reading or whatever is, I feel like that reading is on here. And I'd already, I still got another, I still have, how you say, I still have other videos on the YouTube. So, What else to clarify this um, magician justice card? Yeah, the moon card came. Yeah, truth and clarity. Somebody don't want. The moon card actually came out in reverse this time. And it's coming out over here on these cards over here with the just with the justice, the coffin, the gift and the change. 
it came out on top of those in reverse. Like somebody don't want that to be brought out. Yeah, somebody got money. Because adjudication, coffin, gift, change. Somebody was giving money to call the animal control to cause a change or to cause an ending. They don't want this to be found out. Moon, moon card in reverse with the Ace of Swords. About what they was doing to try to, what the sacrifice they was trying to do to mess with some what somebody got going on, or just to have somebody in, like I said, inconvenience energy. They they not they they not trying to speak on that. This will be something that they probably will even try to keep till they leave this earth. Keep that a secret till they leave out of here. It's so funny how people be doing that type of shit like that, but they not bold enough to like say what the fuck they did. Anything else pertaining to this energy as pertaining to um who called animal control on me about snow? Anything else to clarify this energy? We got the tower in reverse. Clarify the tower in reverse. The king of swords with the seven of wands. Some kind of, um, yeah, some kind of quick thinking, quick action. With them not being in clear mind, it didn't go the way that they wanted it to go. Whatever, whoever thought, whoever thought this was, you know, because basically that's what it is anyway, because it's done and over with. But I'm just saying, this is what's coming out anyway. The tower in reverse with the king of swords sideways. And then it's over on top of the um, ace of pentacles and the ace of wands. Wildly enough. Anything else? The page of cups in reverse. Yeah, they not. They definitely not looking to apologize or give an apology. Whoever, excuse me, whoever got part in this, they ain't. They ain't looking to give no apology because they feel like they wasn't wrong for doing it. But like I said, let me be so, which I am a very concern, a, a very um, concerning, compassionate person. But not, I've learned, you know, currently to just not just leave certain things alone. As far as like, I'm not about to, unless it's like really something like, like real serious i'm going i'm leaving it alone like if i see somebody getting like attempted to be i'm gonna try to do my best to do what i can do um or let somebody else know but as far as like just calling some calling on somebody about something they got going on when i would not even trying to ask them or give an offer of help i'm i'm not i'm not doing that or i'm gonna just mind my business and then if I need to say something, I'll say it. But anything else to clarify this power when you reverse with the Page of Cups and the King of Swords sideways? Yeah. Six of Wands came back out. It is, whoever this was, something that they thought they was doing. Yeah, they thought they was going to slow. What they were slowly doing, they thought they was going to have me in regret. And that they was going to have some kind of quick fulfillment for what they did. Yeah, it definitely was two people or a couple or something because they was waiting for something to come in for them. But it ain't. Oh, that was a that was a death card. <laughs> that was a death card. Nope. Something that somebody thought whoever was working together with who, whatever how it go, they ain't get what they thought they were gonna get. It ain't happen like they thought it was. Yeah, maybe somebody could be in panic mode now, or they was after they figured out something wasn't going their way for what they were trying to do. Mm 
And let's end this out with these cards. Yeah, maybe somebody going to end up telling on themselves about the whole situation or about who actually called. When they should have been just like, really, honestly, they should have been just minding their business. What else to clarify this energy in regards to who called the animal control on me about my dog? What else from this pile? Shaman came out. What else? <laughs> 11th house community. Well, 11th house in astrology talks about communities. Collective, friendship, social circle, wishes, earned wealth, philanthropy, and adopted stepchildren. We got deer. It says um, gentleness, innocence, intuition, unconditional love, safety, strength, and protection. We got the empress coming out in reverse, which talks about um, scarcity, hardships, bareness, neediness, infertility shutting down um negligence disharmony emotional overwhelm yeah somebody definitely wanted to have me in hardships with this with this past situation which is messed up okay so this was sticking out it says intentionally Doing to keep all of you near me as long as possible. It says someone is being kept in humane and someone is being kept in inhumane conditions or sexual abuse. Oh wow. I don't know what that got to do with anything. It don't got nothing to do with this energy. I'm what it came up to. Mm. What else to clarify this energy from this pile of cards? Earth Angel is at the top of the deck. A scammer. So something with scammer could be significant. Again. Any other cards to clarify about who called the animal control on me about my dog? This is sticking out. Or this could be this that energy that person could be just part of it. We got bike trail. That person, that energy could just be part of this somehow. Like they could be part of a group or or these two people or more people or whatever that knew about it. Hey nephew! Wow, that came out again. That's crazy. I don't know where that part is coming from. Compulsive. Somebody was compulsive at doing something. It says compulsive, resulting like um. Doing something against someone's wishes. So somebody definitely did something against my wishes as far as calling the animal control about my dog. Any other cards from this pile to clarify this energy? Let's see. Any other cards to clarify this energy that's out here on the table? We got social media clout. We got committed to a routine. It says give it. Oh, okay. That came out. I 
don't know. It was it, it like maybe this could be. I definitely feel like this person could have been in a in a relationship with somebody. Yeah, the Knight of Cups just came out with. Wow, ambush ambush attack. Okay, so the Knight of Cups came out in the upright. Something with an offer or somebody could have been, like I said, given an offer to do this or call or whatever. Or they was offered something. Something with an offer. Because I don't think this was romantic wise. I don't, or maybe, this, like I said, this person could be somebody who was in a, um, a relationship or is in a relationship or however that go. Anything else to clarify this energy? Yeah, they definitely was taking advantage of another person, which was me. Wow. Oof. You got stay-at-home mom and dad. So, like I said, something about a relationship, somebody, whoever, how it go. Or they could just be part of a group or something like that. That, like, that message card, they could have been, like, you know... When people be in group chats and they be like discussing shit in group chats and, you know, somebody in the group chat could have been like in a relationship or however they go. Anything else to clarify this energy? I don't want to take all of those. Yeah, somebody definitely part of some kind of group or whatever. Because Eastern Star just came out. Anything else to clarify this energy that's out here on the table? And I'm not about to take all of these. Ooh, wait a minute. No, let's put all that back. But I did see taking advantage of again. I see um, pregnant and frustrated. It's a trap. Uh, Wow. Any other cards from this pile? And I'm going to get one more pile. Uh, is that bullying? Or... Yeah, something with cyberbullying. Like I said, the message card can mean like phone, text, social media, whatever kind of form of um, communication. Yep, wow, you got spirit, uh, supernatural gifts and um, hoodoo. So somebody could have been actually using some kind of, it says sorcery or spirit possession or voodoo. Maybe this person knows how to do that or knows somebody else that knows how to do that or something like that. And then they could have been like boasting and like, certain kind of ways online about what they did or whatever and stuff like that. To other people in that group chat or whatever, how it like, oh, wow. Today you got Android tap. Yeah. Cause somebody definitely wanted to fight for whatever reason. So this is, could have been the reason why they did it. Because their heart chakra is in the reverse, which talks about maybe they did this because they was having some kind of difficulty in the relationship or, I don't know, something with them with their heart chakra being not open because it's not in the upright. Yeah, somebody that could be trying to figure out if they're going to be in or out of my life. So maybe that dude could have something to do with the Knight of Cups that offer or... Maybe some kind of offer or something pertaining to the past or something like that. But they heart chakra is closed. So they wanted to, yeah, I just seen judgment. So they wanted to cause like friction. You got bias that came out. You have blessings. Giving up on the connection. Now they want to play quiet and out of sight. What I, I said that er, not earlier when I just did this. I hope I can put this on YouTube. Um, suppressing their feelings. 
something about 2025 is significant. I don't know why that came out, but okay. Because I did make the card, but I'm not sure why that's coming out. Let's get a different call of cards, and then I'm going to get off of this live video. I just wanted to see, because I rarely do lives on here. So, since I got my page activated and not deactivated, I'm like, in the mood tonight, and why not? See property, so something with property might be significant. Oh, this might be enough cards. Anything else from this pile to clarify this energy as to what who called animal control on me about my dog? Anything else from this pile, please and thank you. I see sex workers, so they could have been spreading gossip, rumors, lies that some, you know, basically that I was a sex worker. Yeah, look, commit to came out. They was committed to that. So definitely that could have been part of it. They was committed to doing what they did pertaining to this and committed to whatever else. Yeah, it says they have a handler. They took an oath. So they definitely is in some kind of group. Or cult organization, whatever the hell. <laughs> Why does it keep coming out? That came out. But I don't feel like that's, I don't know. I want to say relevant. I don't know. But I'm about to put it back because I don't know. It came, this is the second time it just popped out. <laughs> I see distant relative. Oh, wow. You got remanded without bail. This was somebody was hoping that's, that's what was going to happen. In the past, that's what they thought it was gonna, what was going to happen. What else to clarify this energy pertaining to who called animal control on me about my dog? Anything else from this call? Because I still feel some type of way and I'm not even going to act like I don't. Because... That was a whole inconvenience for me on some real, real ish. That was. And I ain't sitting up here doing that to nobody. For people to be so fucking just, just nasty and don't give a fuck about nobody but they so. <laughs> we got a racist group that came out. Um, oh, it's some with racist group could be significant. It says this have this have been done before, just a different day. And then that's racist group that came on. All right, anything else to clarify? Who called animal control on me about my dog? Anything else? I'm also just getting, when that Emperor card came out, and then I said something about the Queen of Pentacles, why I'm feeling like that could have been something with a celebrity or like somebody that got some kind of like, how you say, power or authority to like like that, that could have also had, or I mean, it's not, how you say, what am I trying to say? Allegedly, but shit, at this point, I don't know because I still ain't heard the damn, um, the what's the name? I probably won't never hear it, ever hear it, but that's what I just got from that. Or even if it's just somebody in a community that has a lot of connection and pull and stuff like that to be doing things and causing people to be in legal situations. You got the tower card coming up in the upright, which talks about a sudden change, disruption, chaos, adversity, unexpected change, new awareness, destruction. Somebody definitely wanted to cause chaos and destruction. Yeah, certain individuals cannot be trusted, can't be trusted, or cannot, whatever, or whatever, which one. 
anything else before I get out of this video. It says, only intentions is to siphoning a person's male-female energy. So that was part of a, um, like I was going to say, a tactic. Yeah, whoever you're thinking of. So since I really don't know, it could be anybody. Shit, it could be somebody real close to me or somebody not real close to me. It could be a family, it could be a friend, an associate, an, uh, somebody who don't like me, which will be considered a hater or an enemy. Any of those people. Yeah, the Seven of Swords just came out. Ooh, and look what the fuck I said. A cult covenant that preys on singles they see a value. And then the Seven of Swords just came out in the reverse. That talks about theft, deception, secrets being withheld, or excuse me, secrets being held back, taking more than your fair share. So this definitely is like a cult or a covenant of people, male and female, or males, or just females, or both, like I just said. Anything else to clarify who called animal control on me about my dog? Every person act every person that act like they every person that act like <coughs> they like you is in a relationship or a sexual one. A person what's this? I got so many damn cards. That's crazy. Yeah. Oh. I said that, friend of me. So somebody who don't like me, a person who is, or this is just part of the, one of these people that's part of this cult that told somebody else something and, you know, so forth and so forth. A friend of me is a person, um, excuse me, is a person who is or pretends to be a friend, but who is also in, the, in some ways an enemy or a rival. Got it. My day is distracted because I think about you. Shake my head. So somebody who act like they a friend, but they really not. And um, they could be, like I said, they could be in their head with the, in their head thinking about what they did or their part in what, how, how it, what they did or whatever like that. Yeah, because they don't want to see me happy. Somebody definitely don't want to see me happy. Oh, wow. So it could be like, even though it's people in the cult, somebody could be mad. A, a man could be in their thoughts that don't want to see me happy. And a female. What the fudge, yo? That's funny how they both came out. That is funny. Let me get up out of here. This, ooh, we. You got a. Uh, Fortune 500 company, five star. And you got clear tasting. Something about clear gustance is significant, which is clear tasting. So somebody could be clear gustance. Gustance. That has to do one the, with one of the clair, clairvoyant um, senses or whatever how you call that. Ooh. Anything else for the final and last time? Yeah, somebody could have got some money. I ain't going to say they got this much money, but somebody definitely could have got some money. And they got it from the male. So I'm about to take both of those since I see both of them. So somebody most definitely was getting paid. Yeah, you got the star coming out again. So the star came out twice in this energy. Because um, somebody definitely was arrogant. They was hopeful. But, and they was in, like, or this is what they wanted for me. With them being in that arrogant energy. Because the star verse talks about, um, yeah, because somebody felt like they wanted to catch, some, catch me in the act. Which was, you know, I don't know. And I was thinking before I got on here, like, 
somebody could have been watching something prior and then called the animal control. Yeah. Wow, you got personal items stolen. Stolen. You got Decepticons. And then, like I said, the star card came out in reverse, which talks about arrogance, defeatism, loss of faith, demission, hope, demission, demissioned hope, disappointment, missed opportunities, and despair. Somebody definitely wanted me to be missing opportunities by being um, held up in this legal situation. Yeah. If I keep pulling one more, I just said that somebody and then outside of a house. So somebody could have been watching outside of the house with something and then called animal control while wow, settling out of court. That is wild how these all coming out like that. And, and they could have been mad because, you know, I feel like I've been getting people calling me that a witch. But what proof that you got that I'm. People is like I could have been a witch hunt my whole life. Like this just because I've been getting more into the tarot and oracle cards and all that. Like people is they they call me weird, but they weird. I'm ending on this note. I'm done. I'm done. What the last card say? Receiving money or what desire for their uh, their participation. And then you got a house that came out. Even though I wasn't in a house, but it was a house. Even though it was it was apartments, but it was it was a house. So that's funny. It's not funny, but it, it's it's like what. The I'm not, I'm not even like, I don't know how to explain it, but that's the card. Like house and house already came out. Star energy already came out. Mm -mm -mm. That's crazy. I'm about to, let's see. What do I need? To, what do I want to ask the, um, the dice, the astrology dice? What do I want to see with that? Oh, let's see. What is what's the possible signs of the person that called the animal control? So there go house, like I said, there go house right there. And there go house. But let's see, let's use these astrology dice. Even though this only got one. One zodiac sign dice. You know what? Let me not use those. Let's use the cards instead. Let's use those. The comb is there. So that means um, definitely this is confirmation. Somebody of authority, 10th house authority, which is the emperor energy. Somebody that got some kind of power, pull strings, whether it's male or female. Because they was expecting to get some kind of money or just something out of it, doing it, doing that. Or they did get something out of doing that. Whatever it was. Yeah, somebody that was in a relation. Why all these damn confirmation? This is crazy. Mm -mm -mm. Crazy, crazy, crazy. That's why I ain't really been trying to deal with nobody. Cause I, if I ain't gonna find out who told, who did that, I'm not dealing with nobody like that. I'm sorry, cause I, I, I felt that was wrong. What is the sign of the person that called animal control on me? Something's going to be coming out about that. So they could be an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, even though this is the sun card. Yeah, some mystery. The eighth house is just like the death. That's also death card energy. Did I pick that card up? Nope. 
Let me pick that card. Where is it? <laughs> this is fucking comical now, in a way. But there got a death card that fell on the floor. And look what's at the back of the death. Eighth house is the death house is death house. Eighth house is the death card in um or in the oracle deck. Eighth house talks about death, um, transformation, occult, magic. We already seen the card that talk about, I mean that said covenant or cult. So what's the sign of the person that called animal control on me? Any other cards to clarify that energy? What's their sign of the person who called animal control on me? What's their sign? It might be a Scorpio. What's the sign of the person that called animal control on me? God damn it, one more card. Definitely somebody in the community with the 11th house. I'm having these cards that keep going on the dance floor. Oh, we got Capricorn. Yeah, they definitely thought they was going to achieve something by doing that. Any other signs for the final or last time? Of who possibly called the animal control on me. They wanted to cause discomfort. That's not a sign. But um, I also get the devil. I mean that's the devil card. Capricorn energy is the devil card. So they definitely was in a shadow side. Because it had to do with money. We already seen the confirmation more than one time already. Yep, they definitely thought that was going to arrive fast, but it didn't because the car went over here off to the side, almost on the floor. We got Gemini. They was working with, like, they was, with cross-pollinate, it's like they was in this group or they was cross communicating with other people people that might not might maybe not even a friend because money was involved abundance is coming out here you guys dick uh excuse me dignified strength back of the deck i'm closing it out we got aquarius in 11th house all right so i'm done i'm gonna see if i can post this on my channel Cause I want to and I feel like it. Yeah, wow, it just split at um descendant and invitation and Scorpio investigate. Somebody was sent in to like investigate. With me being in that house, like, with doing some kind of voyeurism or whatever. Like I said, I was feeling like somebody had been in my apartment while I wasn't there. Even though I felt like the same way over here, too, because I got evidence of, cause of how the door looked. That part in the door. So, yeah. Off of this live video and go back on YouTube. We'll see if I can download this video to the ch channel. It's, it's so funny how people you know they be so easy, or even people that you don't know, because don't be the main. Well, no, it be the ones that more you know than the ones that's not. But it's so funny how people be so eager to cross you when. They don't even know you or, you know, like when they end up going through something, 
you know, themselves. Like, they, you be so easy, so quick, people be so quick to do that. But then when they end up going through some shit, you know, they need to think about that. Think about that when you was causing discomfort and, um, you know, inconvenience for somebody else. Because you wanted to have them all tied up in some legal situation. Yeah, that was one of the first cards that came out with the um, tail deck. They was passionate about doing that shit. Yep, there go the eighth house mystery again. Let me get off of here because, I mean, I'm going to just keep pulling the cards that I'm supposed to see or whatever, you know, that I'm supposed to see, like I said. All right, let me close this out. <laughs> this is crazy.